everybody, Lance Allen here, and today I want to bring you a new lesson. Uh, I've been, in the last couple of years, a really big fan of Jack Johnson's music, and he just released a new song called New Axe, and I want to teach it to you. Uh, it's a real cool little song, and uh, there's a couple ways you could do it. Uh, the way I'm doing it is in standard tuning, so you could do it that way, or you could do a drop G of the A and a drop D of this. And that kind of works out, but it does make some of the chords a little more difficult, but I found it kind of easy to do in standard tuning. So it has kind of a cool folky technique, not necessarily finger picking, but a little bit of finger picking and strumming at the same time. So the first chord we'll start off with is G, and I've got my first finger on the G root note, and my pinky finger stretches to uh, the third, or the B note, up on the first string. And um, the way it starts out is kind of like a thumb up, thumb up, and you kind of can strum up, and you can be kind of graceful with this. You, you can hit string two, three, or four. It doesn't matter. You can hit one, you can hit four, you can hit two. It doesn't matter. I think it's, it's all acceptable. And then when you do this, you're going to kind of flick your fingers down to get this sort of a, almost like a percussive element, but then you hit the melody note too. And then you're going to come up with a finger to hit that first string again. One and two and then you bring your little finger to fret five and you're going to do a pinch. And you're going to do two note, two, uh, two pick strokes of that. So you get this. One and two and three and four. That last bit is a strum. One and two and three and four. Then the middle finger on the third fret of the G chord is an upstroke with a finger. Either your middle or third finger is acceptable, or even your first finger if you wanted to do only one finger, like that would work as well. One and two and three and four and one and two, three, four, one. And at the end of that, I'm just kind of doing one and two kind of like a strum. All right, so here's what it sounds like. Good, okay, so that's kind of the intro. When you start singing, you don't have to do the melody notes. You just kind of got myself a new wax for chopping all this wood. So you can just do a little finger up here, and then the G, pinch on both of those. Actually, the first one is one and two and three. That's it. All right, when you go to the next chord, it's a C chord, and you want your little finger up on the G string like so. There's no movement here at all. You just kind of do that for uh, four counts, or two bars, and then A minor. Minor seven, so really all you gotta do is lift the third finger off, and then you're back to that's how that goes. All right, now the chorus has a special chord, it's a D add nine. And there's a melody note kind of going da, 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 da. it's doing that and you can just play this chord it's like a c chord just moved up a whole step and it's four bars so you're going to hang out there for a while one two three four one two three four our root note is the fifth string if you notice there Now here's a cool little thing I like to do, and I just, just sort of discovered this. Uh, I kind of like that. It's almost like the melody, uh, but you're playing it on the guitar. And here you would pinch, up strum, 
get you a little percussive strum and an up strum after that and up with the finger one and two and then you move to here the G note one and two and then the F sharp three and four and and then an open note and then you want to switch fingering so you can get this high B note then an A which is there and then the uh, F sharp and then the G that's a bit of a stretch, but it's cool. Here's what it'll sound like. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Back into the thing. get back into the timing of that I'm still working on that myself uh, but yeah so that's a really cool little tune uh, new acts by Jack Johnson hopefully you go check it out uh, on your favorite streaming service and don't forget that you can check my music out too on Spotify Pandora Apple wherever you listen to music uh, make sure you subscribe here at the Guitar Lancer channel and uh, if you feel free if you liked the lesson here today feel free to send me a cup of coffee using the PayPal link below and uh, appreciate you guys listening to my music as well on P Panda and all those places. I think I, I said that. Anyway, thanks for the lesson. Don't forget to leave a comment and have a good day.